This musical journey begins with a name. With questions of who, why, where, and how. I am Mio Nomura, and this is my musical journey. Born in 1988, I was fortunate enough to be raised in a musical family and that I uh, was fortunate too to develop my own music. Um, my mom was a singer and uh, she was a really huge fan of the Motown legends such as Shirley Bassey, uh, Ella Fitzgerald, Nina Simone and um, Bing Crosby. And my dad was a huge fan of the Bee Gees. So I think uh, the combinations of them make a very pure character that is me. And um, I guess um, the maturity of the music begins when I was growing up in Australia as well. Stay down, just stay down, just stay down. I was starting to uh, listen to uh, musicians like Bon Iver, Arcade Fire, Florence and the Machine, and so on. There, so the only guy that I can uh, talk to about things generally was my own brother. We started talking about, you know, the society and all the things that's going on uh, in our environment. And, uh, I shared out to him. So I think uh, those kind of things are becoming the lyrics of you and know, myself. So then um, I came back. I returned home. And then uh, I thought of, you know, scratching things out and just, you know, writing the lyrics again. But then I was sort of missing my, my own brother. I wanted him to be there when I was writing the lyrics. So I started collaborating with him uh, with the music. And then You Want My Love came out. And I didn't even expect that big, like, it gets me to places like the Rolling Stones and then Jaffa Rock and then that I think that was the beginning of it all. Don't you ever wanna love somebody? 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 Don't you ever I guess I was never really satisfied about the songs or the music that I wrote, so I keep on writing and writing again and again. The past to pass. My vocal is bluesy, but then like the influences that I had through my life, the music, the differences of music that I was taught. Um, it's so different to uh, the music that I listened to when I was a kid. It's going to be something big uh, in the music scene. I think as I lived in different places, witnessing different traditions, I learned that no matter where I come from, I wanted to share my music to the world. 